Hello everybody. Uh, 40, 42 months uh, kitchen in entry recycles in uh, five minutes. Uh, it will be very short video. I will show you how to calculate uh, this cycle uh, with timing solution. Uh, actually, there are two variant cycles. I actually, I will show what parameters to play to vary. And uh, you see also I will show you how to calculate predictable zones because you see predictable zones sometimes sometimes not coincide with projection line. So they can uh, they work a little bit different. So let's start. So uh, to um, uh, calculate uh, economical cycles, uh, I recommend to download as much price history as it possible. So I will download the Dow Jones and of data it's available since 1885. I downloaded it through time solution data feed. Okay, here it is. I click download, and now I click OK, OK, OK. Done. So, next step. Uh, next step, uh, we run timing solution at <laughs> TS Spectrum model. Uh, here it is. Click this button. But you see, we can use actually uh, timing solution templates uh, using clicking this button. Uh, just a second, I will move it here to see, you need to see the menu. Okay, you see, click this button, you will see different options here. First option, working with uh, permanent economical cycles. Click it and program will calculate a, a spectrum uh, adjustable to um, uh, find, to reveal economical cycles. It calculates uh, about one minute. Almost done, and you see uh, kitchen cycles are here. The most strongest one, this one, uh, this period, 42.18 months cycle. And uh, this one, the period, it's 40.59 uh, uh, months cycles. Uh, but you see, it seems to me, it seems to me 42 month cycle works better because you see 40, 40 month cycle here it is it shows uh, uh, shows this while 42 month cycle uh, looks better from my point of view okay I will remove this uh, cycles cycle and I leave only 42 month cycle this is projection line uh, for kitchen inventory cycle and uh, next step I will show you how I calculated uh, predictable zones based on this cycle. You see, I click uh, this button, composite, and shows how this cycle works in time. time. This vertical stripe, vertical line, uh, this is current date, uh, today is uh, February 25, 2025, and now I will uh, find predictable zones for this cycle. Click uh, calculate vector field, okay? And you see, you see these red lines and shows uh, red arrows represent uh, uh, downtrend predictable zones. So I will choose, uh, for example, from here to here. You see, it shows uh, price goes uh, five, five times it goes down and uh, two times only goes up. So this is predictable zone for uh, this uh, cycle. Uh, next, uh, you see, this is parameter, uh, parameters to play. Uh, the technique, is, uh, technique I show you, this is kind of a standard model in physics. Uh, particle physics, uh, there is a, a standard model. This is actually standard model, how uh, physicists understand particles now. And, um, and you see... Uh, what I recommend to play? I recommend to play with uh, first level uh, with uh, FSM parameter uh, for cast stock memory. Here I used last seven cycles. In other words, to calculate this projection line, I used last seven cycles. If we set it to zero, it will um, use all available press history or, or will use only three last cycles three last cycles, but let's check it uh, how wall correlate efficiency uh, will look. Look at this blue and red lines. I will increase, increase sample size. And if I set it to, for example, to zero, to zero, it's we have a, a, a three, a 10 plus uh, three minus. If it's set to seven, 
Yeah, we have the same. If we have, have set three, yeah, we have the same. Okay, practically all shows show the same, but uh, uh, actually you can play the, with this projection line. So this is projection line based on all available price history, not on last seven cycles, all, all available price, price history. And this projection line looks this way and predictable zones will look uh, different as well. Uh, let's, I will remove this predictable zones, it does not work now. And so click um, calculate vector field and we'll get another predictable zones. And uh, maybe this variant will work, but in this case, uh, drop start will be somewhere here. Okay, so in this case, um, uh, we are getting a drop, uh, drop will take place. Uh, when it will take place uh, close to August, close to August. So this is another variant. So uh, this is uh, two possible scenarios for kitchen inventory cycles. Uh, so as you see, it's very everything is uh, very simple. Thank you.